Yeah, I got currently stepped down. Well, I stepped down to this program that I'm currently at, and I still am serving two years on my sentence. Um, I am currently full-time college student right now. I am... I am doing full-time college. Uh, I'm restricted in this house because, I, like I said, I'm currently still serving time. I was released on good behavior. Um, kind of like my story was like, so like my past, like I kind of seen like one of my loved ones get hurt at a very young age. So like that kind of traumatized me and like kind of made me like just angry at certain individuals. And like I ended up getting charged with committing a violent crime. I did commit a violent crime and um, I ended up going to jail for that crime based on being impulsive in my emotions. But like throughout jail, like I didn't took in so many courses like anger management, so much like courses that are like self-help like courses, emotional intelligence, all that stuff. And like I later on end up seeing that like like the same way that happened to my brother, something probably happened to my victims. So like the same feeling I had, like it kind of made me feel like empathetic in a way, you know? And like, that's kind of the reason why I want to get my life together. Like, and also my mom, I also have a brother that's also incarcerated as of right now. He is in the county jail. Um, so my mom's kind of like alone. And it's like, that makes me think like, damn, like, if I get incarcerated again, what's going to happen to my mom? Like, she tells me she hates this feeling of being at home. Like, and currently now, like I said, I'm still kind of restricted. So it's like, I can't just be with her. I can't just go out with her. So like, she's so happy for me that I'm out, I'm going to college. So like, that kind of keeps me going, you know? And also like, I'm currently like, I don't know, like I have so many good mentors. So it's like, there's no reason for me to fail. Like, I got good mentors, like just pushing me out, like supporting me through life, like supporting me in my, something I'm also trying to get into trading, my boy, Anthony, go Anthony. Um, yeah, like, I just, I feel like there's no excuse, you know, like if I were to, Go back to the system like this time they shouldn't give me no pass because like at the end of the day the only reason i'm out today because the juvenile laws protected me like my brain wasn't fully developed and still is not because i'm currently 18 years old so like but i feel like that shouldn't be an excuse for me to like try to take that into advantage and like oh my brain's not fully developed so i can go do what i want like no that's not that shouldn't be an excuse for me you know so like i feel like there's just i just have too much potential to go out there and do act dumb or act a fool, you know, like result back to my old lifestyle or whatnot. So like, yeah, it's pretty much my story. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Giovanni, for um, sharing your story.